Hello friends, welcome back to your channel Test to Technology. Today I am going to show how to install secondary DNS server step by step. So friends, in my previous video, we have installed Active Directory and by default install the DNS role on it. So motive of this video to create secondary DNS server. So today I am performing this task rename the computer name, configure static IP address and domain joining, install DNS server role, enable zone transfer on primary DNS server, create secondary zone on secondary DNS server that is our new server. So verifying all the data has been transferred to secondary DNS server. So friend, without wasting your time, I am going to my lab. So friend, here we are taking new Windows Server 2022 as a secondary DNS server. So I am going to Server Manager. So before we start this installation, we need to rename the server name and as well as configure the static IP address. So friend, first of all, we configure the IP address. I'm going to network place. We need one static IP address. So I'm using 192.168.184.101 because my primary DNS server IP address is 100. So I am putting the default gateways 192.168.184.1. So you need DNS server. I just putting the 192.168.184.100. Okay. Then click OK. Okay, so now is connected. So I just check with the ping, ping 192.168.184.1 is a, our gateway server. Now is able to ping. Okay, so second is you need to rename the Windows Server computer name. So I'm click on work group. So here is the option to change. So I'm just putting the name of DNS2022. That is our secondary DNS server. And I'm putting the domain name that is, that is uh, touch to technology. Dot local, click OK. Asking the credential, you put the credential. So my case is administrator by using administrator and password. Click OK. So here is showing welcome to test to technology dot local domain. OK. Before restarting, okay, so we need close, restart the server.
So friend, I'm going to primary DNS server. Okay. I'm logging this machine. Okay. I'm open with DNS server. Okay. You can check DNS 20122. You can check here DNS is registered. DNS 2022. And IP address is 192.168.184.101. Okay. And under the primary is also registered DNS 2022. Here is AD2022, that is our primary DNS server. And IP address is 192.168.184.100. Okay, so I'm going back to our secondary DNS server. Okay. So you can enter your password. Okay. Okay, some services are stopped, no issue. Right click and start. Okay, so Okay, good to go. Again, one service that is update service. Click on start. Okay. Okay. So, friend, I am just click on the server manager and click on the add roles and features. So, we need to configure our DNS role. Okay. So, I am just clicking on the DNS server. Okay. Click on next. So friend, no need to select anything. Click on next, next. So here is asking for installation. Click on installation. So friend, waiting for get the installation done. So installation is done. Now click on close this window. Okay. Then click on tools. Here is the DNS. You can also verify from here. So DNS is installed. Okay. Click on dashboard. See here is the DNS role configured. So now I'm click on tools. Click on DNS. Okay. So here is the DNS. Okay. 
So I'm going back to our primary DNS server. Okay. Then click on test to technology. Okay. Then click on properties. Here is one option, zone transfer. You can allow the zone transfer. So here is the three options to any server, only listed server, or only by following IP address. So in my demo environment, I'm choosing first one, to any server, apply, okay. And also, I am with, also, same process, following to our reverse lookup zone. Okay, then click on properties. Here is the option zone transfer. Click allow to zone transfer. First one. So friend, you can use second because only this for security reason only to server listed on the name server tab. Okay. Okay. So refresh. Okay. I'm going back to our secondary DNS server. So friend, we need to configure secondary zone. So I am in DNS server of secondary DNS server. So I just right click on the look up zone. Click on new zone. Click next, select the secondary zone. Click next and putting the your join name. In our case, that is test to technology. Click on next. You can put the primary DNS server IP address is showing master server. So in my case, 192.168.184.100. Okay, verify. Click on next. Finish. So it will take more time. Okay, no issue. I'm going to reverse zone and right click on zone new zone and create the secondary zone okay same ipv4 range so put the range network id in my case 192.168.184 okay put the your primary dns server ip address 192.168.184 or 100 Okay, verify, click on next, finish. Okay. So friend, see, DNS is replicated from here. So, call is good. Okay, so friend, I'm going back to our primary DNS server. So first of all, you can check here is the your fully qualified DNS name. So I just copy. Okay, right click on primary DNS forward zone property and paste and resolve okay is verifying okay so now i am able to add the secondary name server okay okay see here is one ns name and second the ns name okay okay you can also add if you need i just click on properties okay name server Add, paste, resolve, okay. So good to go, everything is good. So friend, thank you for watching this video. Hope you like all the videos and please subscribe the channel and also you can click on the bell icon for new updates.